It has been another big week for AI, and it's high time for a weekly news roundup of the super cool stuff happening in the world of artificial intelligence. We've got some exciting stories about new AI features, leadership transitions, smart technologies, and even how AI is helping scientists find genes linked to Alzheimer's disease. Let's jump right in. Tuku's AI scan predicts heart conditions in 20 seconds. So have you ever heard of Tuku? Well, it's this cool company using artificial intelligence to check your health, and they do it in a pretty unique way. So the CEO, Ishan Vang, got inspired by his dad who lost his eyesight, and he decided to use technology to help lots of people. They've got this super smart system called Claire that can read signals in your eyes and tell if you might have heart problems. It's so quick, just 20 seconds, and it might even become a regular thing at eye checkups. Tuku's not on the market yet, but it's getting some special approval from the big health people. So maybe soon, going to the eye doctor could tell you more than just your glasses prescription. Up next, what if I told you there's a super smart AI that can understand pictures. Well, with GPT-4 or Turbo with vision, it's like magic for photos. You know how we usually talk to AI with words. Now it can chat about what it sees in images too. Like, it's not just saying, that's a cat. It can tell a whole story about the cat, maybe even predict what it's thinking. Imagine that. It's so cool that even companies like Instacart and Stalia are using it to make grocery shopping and videos better. And here's the best part, it's coming soon and we're all going to be part of the AI picture revolution. Speaking of being part, the team management and productivity tool Notion is getting a cool upgrade. They're introducing this awesome thing called Q&A, and it's like having a virtual assistant right in your app. Imagine asking it anything, and it finds the info super fast, just like magic. It's not just search, it's like chatting with your app, and it only costs eight to $10 a month. CEO Ivan Zhao called it a mix of search engine and a chatbot. So no more digging for stuff. Q&A brings it all to you. How cool is that? Time to make our digital lives even easier. Next up, picture having your health checkup in a fancy booth at the mall or gym, like a health kiosk from the future. Forward CEO, Adrian Arun, spilled the beans, and I'm here to spill them to you. So what's the buzz about CarePods? They're like health superhero booths. You tap your phone, pick up what you need, like a body scan or heart check, and the pod does the rest. It gives you results and plans without seeing a doctor in person. Real doctors check your info behind the scenes. It's like your health tech in your neighborhood. Imagine health checkups at malls or offices. Forward's making it happen. So get ready for CarePods, your health, your way, anytime, anywhere. Moving on, we've got a Google DeepMind creation called GraphCast. It's like a super brainy AI that looks at tons of weather data to predict what's gonna happen up to 10 days in advance. It's faster and more accurate than usual weather predictions. Imagine knowing if it's gonna rain at your football game or if a big storm is coming. GraphCast can tell you. The cool part, it doesn't just stop at regular weather. It can spot cyclones early, figure out if there's gonna be a flood, and even predict when it's gonna get crazy hot. Plus, it's open source, so scientists worldwide can can use it to make better predictions for their areas. GraphCast is like your weather wizard buddy, making sure you're ready for whatever mother nature throws your way. Up next, OpenAI had to hit the pause button on new subscriptions for ChatGPT+. Well, it turns out that after their big dev day conference, everyone wanted a piece of ChatGPT, and it got so popular that OpenAI servers needed a breather. So ChatGPT+, is this cool thing where you pay a little each month to get extra awesome AI features. But guess what? So many people wanted it after the conference that it broke the system. OpenAI CEO Sam Altman said, whoa, we need to catch our breath and hit pause on new signups. But don't worry, if you're eager to jump on the ChatGPT Plus train, you can still sign up to get a heads up when they open the gates again. It's like a virtual line and you won't miss out on the AI goodness. So until then, let's see what cool stuff ChatGPT has in store for us next. Moving on, here's something for the gadget fanatics. Big news from Nvidia. They've just unveiled the HGX H200, a powerhouse AI computing platform. If you're into fancy tech language, it's based on the Hopper architecture and launched the H200 Tensor Core GPU. But what's the buzz? Well, it's got this super advanced memory called HBM3E, making it lightning fast for AI and scientific computing tasks. We're talking about 141 gigabytes of memory at a whopping 4.8 terabytes per second. That's nearly double the old version, the A100. Imagine, it's like upgrading from a bicycle to a rocket. Why does this matter? Well, it's like giving your computer superhero level powers 
cars for AI and super smart computer stuff. And guess what? These supercharged systems are hitting the market in early 2024. So if you're a tech guru or just love futuristic gadgets, keep an eye out for the HGX H200. It's about to make AI computing a whole lot faster. Next up, ever wondered why your favorite Netflix show sounds so amazing? Well, it's not just luck. Netflix spills the beans on their secret weapon, Speech and Music Activity Detection, or SMAD. So what's SMAD all about? It's like a superhero for your ears, precisely measuring speech and music in every audio frame. This tech wizard helps Netflix organize content, making your binge-watching experience even better. SMAD rocks at creating data sets, ensuring Netflix knows exactly what you love. It fine-tunes loudness, making dialogues crystal clear, and music hit all the right notes. Using fancy algorithms and a massive data set, SMAD is the unsung hero behind your Netflix moments. Next time you're hooked on a show, remember, SMAD is a maestro at ensuring every sound is perfect. Next up, Microsoft has introduced something super cool called Everything of Thoughts, or XOT. It's like giving computers a superpower to understand and solve problems even better. Now, instead of just being good at answering questions, XOT helps computers learn from different problems, just like when you play new games and get better over time. Inspired by smart games like AlphaZero, it's like the computer is now a super detective, searching for the best ways to solve puzzles. They tested Exotree on tricky games, and it outsmarted other methods, solving problems like a champ. While we don't know when Microsoft will use this everywhere, it's like turning your computer into a super smart friend who can learn and solve problems better than ever. Thanks to XOT, making talking computers even more awesome. Moving on with another Microsoft model called Chat Anything, it's like your computer is a new superpower. It creates talking characters with their own personality and voice just by typing a few words. Here's how it works. Chat Anything learns from what you write to make characters with unique personalities. It then uses special voices that match them with what you type, making the characters sound just right. The characters look different too. Chat Anything uses smart tech to make them match what you describe. Imagine having your computer talk back with different characters just by typing. Chat Anything makes your computer a creative friend. The tech uses smart models and tricks to make sure the characters look and sound great. It's like magic for your computer conversations. Up next, OpenAI is making bold moves to attract Google's top AI talent, offering annual packages ranging from $5 million to $10 million with a focus on stock incentives. This aggressive recruitment strategy comes as OpenAI's stock sales approach completion, potentially pushing its valuation to over $80 billion US dollars. The talent war between OpenAI and Google intensified, with both companies emphasizing their computing resources. Meanwhile, Microsoft is entering the AI chip arena, developing the Athena chip to compete with the NVIDIA alongside collaborating with AMD and MI300X. It's like they're all trying to be the first to have the best and fastest smart computers in the world. The evolving dynamic in AI hardware highlights a competitive shift in the industry. Moving on, in groundbreaking agreement, US President Joe Biden and Chinese counterpart Xi Jinping are expected to announce a ban on the use of artificial intelligence in autonomous weapons, including drones, and in the control of nuclear warheads. Both countries have expressed concerns about the unregulated use of AI technology in fueling conflicts. The accord addresses potential risks associated with the AI in military applications emphasizing the need for human control over decision-making processes, particularly in nuclear command and control systems. While the U.S. has introduced rules for advanced AI approval, China has also made significant advancements in integrating AI into its military. Despite this positive development, broader consensus on other military matters between the two nations remains a challenge, with ongoing disagreements on various issues. Up next is something that can change the game in AI photo and animation. Runaway ML, a leader in AI technology, introduces Motion Brush, a revolutionary feature set to transform photo animation in its two-gen interface. The Motion Brush allows users to easily animate still images, offering unprecedented simplicity in video and image editing. Integrated into the Gen 2, the tool operates at a higher resolution of 2,816 by 1,536 pixels, providing unparalleled clarity. 
with a focus on precision and user accessibility. Motion Brush is expected to outperform similar tools, marking a significant leap in AI-driven creative applications. The Gen 2 model, including Motion Brush, is available through a credit-based system, setting a new standard in AI-powered creative tools. Moving on, Snap introduces Lens Studio 5.0 with new generative AI lens development tools. Partnering with Dolly and ChatGPT creator OpenAI, the tool combines Gen AI with face mesh technology, making it easier for developers to create expressive AR effects that react to users' faces in real time. Snap also collaborates with 3D AI generator Meshi for generating materials and textures through text prompts, streamlining AR content creation. Additionally, Lens Studio 5.0 introduces a remote API to integrate ChatGPT into lenses, unlocking conversational and creative experiences. Snap's strategic use of AI extends beyond content creation, with features like My AI showcasing the integration of AI as a social companion. Next up, we have an AI revolution in Alzheimer's gene identification. Scientists are harnessing the power of artificial intelligence to uncover genes linked to Alzheimer's disease, with one algorithm sorting through brain brain images to identify Alzheimer's characteristics, and a second method, pinpointing crucial brain structures. Researchers aim to use these visual biomarkers to analyze large databases. The ultimate goal is to pinpoint genes associated with Alzheimer's, advancing treatment, development, and predictive models. This AI-driven breakthrough represents a crucial step forward in understanding and combating Alzheimer's disease. Well, that's a wrap on this week's roundup of AI news. We've witnessed the incredible potential and the challenge of artificial intelligence. It's been an exhilarating ride and the AI journey continues. Who knows what wonders lie ahead. Subscribe to our channel for the next AI and tech updates. Stay curious and stay inspired and keep exploring the extraordinary possibilities of artificial intelligence. I'll catch you in the next one.